All right, good evening, everybody. Hello. Good evening. It's about 8.03 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on this Wednesday, March the 18th of 2020. I want to welcome everyone to the Revitalize the Total Woman podcast show. This is a podcast show that airs on Tuesdays and Wednesdays around 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I am your host, your senior coach, and so welcome aboard, everyone. Uh, This show, this podcast show, is a media outlet for uh, the nonprofit based in Chesapeake, Virginia, entitled Women of Elevation Career Services International. Again, Women of Elevation Career Services International. And this is a 501c3 nonprofit organization based in Chesapeake, Virginia. It also has a location in Nigeria, Africa. And our whole mission for this nonprofit organization is to empower women with the tools to be able to create, relate, and elevate so you can walk in your God-given purpose and ultimately live your dream lifestyles. And so welcome aboard to everyone. Again, welcome aboard. So what we're going to do right now, since I'm primarily live on my timeline, I'm also going to conduct a watch party where I am going live inside of the Women of Elevation community group. So let me go ahead and get this particular party started. Give me a couple of seconds and we'll get started with tonight's episode. So I'm finding the group. The name of the private group on Facebook is called Women of Elevation. And so I'm going to go ahead and get the party started here. So starting it now. All right. And we're going to check the audio, Community make sure group. the audio so is let me good. Go ahead. All right. Sounds like the audio is pretty good for this particular watch party. So again, welcome aboard. So if you're not aware, again, we've been really focusing in uh, for this nonprofits podcast, focusing in on service delivery during the month of March. And so I don't know how many of you out there create services, whether you are mentors, consultants, or coaches, or what have you, uh, but that has really been the focus. We know that, you know, many of you out there, you want to create a, you want to have a big impact on the lives of other people, your target population that you want to serve. And we know that there are certain services out there that can help you to achieve just that. And so I want you to understand that When you're creating services, that there is a specific way that you can do it, whereby it helps people to, you know, be a bit more confident in the decisions that they make when they decide to choose your company. So we may have discussed this a little bit earlier in previous episodes, where you want to start off with a free service, and then gradually, with the services that you provide, you provide a little bit more of a higher ticketed service. And so tonight I'm sharing information about creating a mid-tier level service as well as a high ticketed service, okay? I'm going to give an example of both of them and why they would actually work. Now, I don't, I'm not saying that you have to create it this way or you have to create this particular service, but it's just an example. So mid-tier services, mid-tier services uh, would be somewhat of a, main meal. So for example, if you're going out and you're eating, right? I'm just going to give this as an analogy. If you're going out and you're getting a, a, you're having a full course meal. So the main meal at hand would actually be the mid tier service. Okay. The mid tier service. So what you want to do is you want to create a service that maybe it's um, a six, a six week course that you're providing, that you're offering a certain population of people Uh, And it depends on, of course, on how you want to orchestrate that, whether it be uh, somewhat of, you know, two two sessions a month or doesn't matter how you break it down, but it's the main service that you want to offer. Now, when it comes to a mid-tier service and the pricing of it, you know, it really can be a bit flexible. It can be somewhere around the lines of $297. I've seen it all the way up to $997 for particular main services that companies offer. Now, the pricing of it, you can, you have to look at different factors for the service that you want to offer. So look at your level of experience. Look at how long you've been in business. Look at the type of results you've been generating so far with the service that you want to offer. All of these factors needs to come into place when making a decision as to what the price of a service would actually be. 
Okay, so it doesn't matter if it's consulting, coaching, mentorship, you want to look at all of these factors. Now, when it comes to the high ticketed service, I would say a high ticketed service will be somewhat like an add on, like a cherry on top. So, for example, if you offered a main course, okay, a main course, you want to provide something that's going to give someone a continual support system. So maybe it's like a, a customer service plan where they have six months of access to you via email or via Facebook Messenger, whatever it is that you want to offer them, that's going to be more of an add-on. So you want to provide a level of convenience. You want to provide a level of support that will back up that main meal. Okay, so that's what I, that's what I would consider a high ticketed type of service, or it can actually be one on one. Okay, a one on one type of service, because here's the deal. When you provide a one on one type of service, that one person is occupying a lot of your time as compared to having somewhat of a group coaching program. So having a one on one service, whether it's a one on one consulting service or a one on one coaching service, you know, it's. It's an addition to it. It's something that only a specific or maybe a smaller population of people are going to take advantage of. So that is a possibility, but you want to think about, you know, what your service or what, you know, what it is that you want to offer and whether it makes sense to include a higher ticketed type of service. Now, I personally have done this before. I've offered one-on-one -on -one coaching. I've offered main courses. So I've done all of these things and they work relatively well. Just depends on what you're doing with your business. What is the primary focus for your business? And so when it comes to the higher ticketed services, now that would actually range. Depends on what you're comfortable in, in offering, okay? I don't want you to think, again, like an employee. You have to think in terms of value, okay? When it comes to pricing your higher ticketed service. So for example, if someone wanted to work one-on-one -on -one with me when it comes to being a professional speaker, because I've been in this industry for a while and I know what I'm doing when it comes to helping people to get on the professional speaking track, what I do may be a bit different from what someone else may do because they're just getting involved in the industry or they may not have as much experience. So I may require or request a higher amount because I've been in the industry for some time. So it really depends on what your level of comfort is, your level of experience, and just taking it from there, okay? Taking it from there. And so it can range. Let me give you a ballpark range of what a higher ticketed service cost would be. So it can range anywhere between $997 all the way up to, you know, it can be $1997. And you can break that down. It could be a monthly type of requirement that you request from people. It can be a three-part installment. Depending on what, how it is that you have to set it up, that's how you would set it up for your particular company. So again, these are my suggestions that I'm providing for you. Hopefully, they have been extremely helpful for you. And here is, here is what I want to tell you. For those of you who are looking for more information and more assistance in this area, I invite you to register for the three night of classes that we're going to have starting next week. So we're not going to have the Revitalize the Total Women podcast on next week because we're having the three nights of classes. This is the Telesummit, the Create 2020 Telesummit event. We're going to have three speakers, three premier speakers who are going to be providing valuable content next week. And they're going to be giving it on the Zoom platform. And these three nights of classes are free. Make sure that you have registered for these classes. We're going to be providing the Zoom details in a private group on Facebook. And we're also going to be emailing it out pretty, pretty soon. So make sure, again, that you've registered, you have your seat, and you will be in the building virtually, that is. OK, and you'll be able to get access to the classes and the content. So, again, you want to make sure you head on over to the website that's in the description area of this stream or of the podcast. So the website address is www.thecreatetelesummit.com. Again, www.thecreatetelesummit.com. Telesummit.com. Make sure that when you're registering, you put in the person who referred you. And also, tell a friend, a tell a friend, a tell a friend to also be present. We want to make sure we're spreading the love. We're sowing value into the lives of women all across the world. 
And so we appreciate your time on tonight. We're looking forward to the amazing virtual event that's coming up next week. You all be blessed. Have an amazing evening and we'll be speaking with you soon. Take care, everyone.